What's going on, Bully fam? It's your boy, the educated, the scientist, Mr. Double Muscle Line Bulls, bringing you another quick episode of Breeders Hacks. So today, what we're going to talk about is a neonatal suction machine. Um, this is something we have on BreedersHacks.com. I mean, it. this has been a, a, a lifesaver. Like, I'm going to explain why. It's because of the fact that when you have puppies, newborn puppies especially, when whether they're drinking off of their mothers, whether you're bottle feeding them, whether you have them on a puppy feeder, what can happen is um, milk can wind up getting in their nostrils, can get in the lungs, things like that, and you need to get it out right away before it can turn into a pneumonia, other issues that, I mean, are life-threatening to the puppies. So this is the old school way of doing it. And I mean, we do have these in our in our puppy care kits. It's a little you know handheld aspirator. I mean... They work decently, you know what I'm saying? I mean, if, if you don't have anything else, I would recommend using this. But if you really want to have something that's effective and efficient, that's gonna eliminate the mucus, take it right out of the puppy, this is what I recommend. Um, I mean, this right here is super heavy duty. I mean, this is this is really actually for humans. Um, and, and, it's, and like I said, it's a suction machine. And what it does is, I mean, it, it has um, a, a built-in compressor. From the pressure from the mucus being the pup in the puppy's nose, it eliminates it and rips it right out. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's very difficult um, to harm the puppy with something like this. You would actually have to like, kind of like intentionally um, harm the puppy. Um, this is, it's definitely safe. But um, let me just run through this machine and show you guys real quick, right? So this is the compressor here. What you're gonna do is you're going to connect the hose that comes with it, right? Inside the box to the nozzle right here. You're going to take the elbow bracket and it's going to go up top here and then you're going to go ahead and you're going to get a hose right just like this a green hose now the hose comes with um it comes with a syringe that we've retrofitted to fit into the hose so otherwise without this hose um without this piece here um it, it's too big to get suction on the puppy's nose so what you're going to do is take the hose and connect it to the front of the canister like this, right? So then now you're good to go, you know? And this is the perfect size to hold up to the newborn puppy's nose, you know? So what we've done is you can go ahead and plug it in now and you'll hit the switch here. Where is it? Oh, here we go. And it's ready to go, you know what I'm saying? So on the right side here, you can actually adjust, you can adjust the pressure if you want you know, higher or lower, um, I'm gonna put it a little bit higher, and you can set it to your desired um, pressure, you know what I'm saying? So when you first get it, you're gonna wanna turn it on, make sure it's running smoothly, everything like that. It does need to build up a little bit of pressure, um, but for the most part, I mean, if you, you, you can't really um, see on the video, but as I hold my finger to it, the amount of pressure that it's willing to suck out compared to something like this it, it's just unmatched you know and it'll collect everything here for you in this, con this con container right here i don't know if you can see guys and i mean this thing i mean it, it, it's just great you know what i'm saying like i said um i've used this to save plenty of puppies and if you catch the milk in the nostrils and things like that early enough and you use something like this that will make sure it sucks everything out not so much something like this, you know, that may just get a little bit out. You use something like this that really is going to make sure it gets everything out. You won't have to worry about the life-threatening issues of pneumonia and things like that, you know. Or um, if you have a puppy that just has a lot of mucus going on, yet again, this is going to be great and be able to help possibly save their lives as well as, you know, get all that mucus out and things like that. So, so one key thing about these machines is this um, dial on the side is how you can adjust it. So to loosen it for less pressure, you um, you turn it towards you. Turn it the other way, not towards you, and, and it'll screw closer to the machine, and that'll actually build up more pressure. So now, as you can see, I'm putting my thumb on it, and look at the look at the pressure go up. You see how high it goes up? And that pressure, I believe this machine could go up to like 30 pounds of pressure. But essentially, like I said, it'll it'll build up pressure and, he, and 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 rip the mucus right out. You know what I'm saying? It'll it'll move it right out. So 
I hope this was helpful just to show you guys. Um, I've been meaning to do a video explaining why we have this on the website. I really think it's essential and key for people who are really whelping. You know what I'm saying? Um, so I hope this was helpful. If you got any questions, drop a comment down below. Um, and definitely check out BreedersHacks.com if this is something you'd be interested in. And I'll see you guys on the next episode of Breeders Hacks.